Hey guys, welcome. Yeah, alright. Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Zelda Majora's Mask. Um, we're about to talk to the monkey, I do believe. I'll just keep talking to him like that. And then what you need to do is, um,. Pull out your, you know, instrument. <laughs> so he teaches us a song we can use to get inside the temple. Alright, now I just... Alright, her up. It's a really boring song. So that you guys hear that by moving my mic into my headphone set thing. Ah, too much talking. Sorry if you guys actually want to read this. But otherwise, if you don't, then whatever. It's really not that important, because I can explain this easy. So now we have to go to the temple. Oh, I'm used to Super Metroid's controls. One thing I have to tell you guys is this part is recorded after I've already recorded stuff ahead of this. And if you guys are confused on what I mean, what I mean is um, I had a failed rec uh, recording like this part I was going through right here, like this area, and for some reason, there, that's better. I was going through this flying area, but then I didn't realize my camera was recording a different area than the emulators, so it was recording above it because I accidentally had it set so the camera would follow my mouse. So, um, I had, I moved my mouse above the emulator so I could, so you would guys couldn't see it, and then I was just recording above the emulator the whole time, so I lost all this stuff. But I had everything after that recorded, perfect, so I had to go back and do this part. Do 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 do. Alright, this guy teaches us a song. A song of soaring, it's kind of useful. I'm not gonna listen to him because this owl annoys me. He talks forever. Like, never stops. He's been talk. I just skipped like about 20 things of text right there. Probably over that. Not that hard to learn. Um. a really boring song. This is the purpose of those owl statues. Every time I hit one with my normal sword, it, be it opens its wings, and every one of its wings open. Like, I, once I play this song, I can teleport to all the ones I've already hit with my sword. So, if I hit one at... The, if I hit the one at Clock Town, which I don't think I did, if I hit that one with my sword, then, um... It'll... Whatchamacallit, um... What was I saying? I just kind of lost it. I was staying for some reason. Oh, 
then I'll be able to teleport to that one. And then here, that those two logs are to, on top of the temple. It's underneath the poisoned water. I don't know why everyone's so afraid of it, of the um, moon. I think it looks awesome. All right. Oh gosh, those things always cause me to fall in the water. I mean, they only do it on the emulator. Oh wow, that was strange. Oh, you see what I mean? Alright, let me get you out of my way. Alright, now he's dead. These things bother me a lot, especially on the emulator when I can't control much. Do, 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 do. This is gonna be difficult. Bring it on! Whoa, that was close. There, now he's dead. See, here's an owl statue. Um, and if I turn into- Oh, yeah, I forgot about that fairy in the bottle thing. There we go. Now if I hit this with my sword, that happens, and now that that's happened I can teleport to that. Anyways, I'm gonna end the video right here, and um, because I don't have time to start the temple, but I'm gonna end the video right here. Well, I actually do have the temple already recorded, so yeah, I'm just gonna end the video right here, and if it jumps around, it's because I ended it in a different spot than, the la the ended than I ended it on the failed recording. So if I start out in a different spot in the next video, it's because... I had to go back and do this part, alright? Alright, bye.